In case you guys needed any reason to scream, cry, or throw up today in happiness, I introduce you all to Sullivan, the nine-week-old Rottweiler puppy. Okay, are we gonna give you a bath today? Are you gonna handle it? Oh, good boy. Good boy, Sullivan. Oh, no panicking. Good boy. Yeah, you're okay. I'm gonna touch you with some water. What a good boy. It's okay. Hey, don't bite it. Oh, wow, you are feisty. You're a feisty creature. It's not as loud. Let's do it like this, okay? Good boy. No, no, no. We don't want to freak out. You really stink. What a good boy, Sullivan. What a good boy, Sally. No, no jumping. I'm gonna leave the water running because if I shut it off, turning it back on might scare him. Okay, I'm in the happy hoodie. So this happy hoodie is a size small. Good boy. Very good boy. Yes, no, no, no. No, no, no. All right, you don't even like water touching you. You don't even like water touching you? What a sad puppy. Okay, the sound is off. The sound is off. Okay, I'm just gonna use some diluted tearless here. Okay, buddy. You're okay, you're a really stinky guy. Mr. Sullivan here is a German descent Rottweiler. There's German and American. So he's gonna be a big boy with a big head. The owner tried to find Rottweilers that didn't have docked tails, but had a very hard time finding a breeder that didn't dock the tails. They ended up going with a breeder in the States, even though they are from Canada. Hey. So in case anybody's wondering about the tail, it's not what the owners wanted. More and more breeders are starting to breed with the tail, fortunately, because they do not need to be docked. Okay, 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 okay. We're not going to wash his face today, obviously, because he is very, very nervous. And I do not need to make this even a more scary experience for him today than it already is going to be. So, no washing of the face. No washing of the face today, okay? He is obviously going to be really big. The owners want him to be groomed for the rest of his life. So introducing him at this age is ideal. He is very nervous. I suggested to the owners that they bring him to a groomer every six weeks until he is at least a year old to get him used to it. Especially with the way that he is behaving today, I think he'll be a little bit more difficult to get accustomed to grooming. And they can bathe him at home as well to try to get him used to the water. You're okay. You're okay, you adorable little thing. It's not that bad, buddy. Okay? Good boy. Starting to calm down a little bit. Good boy. You just gotta get that puppy stench off you. You gotta get the puppy stench off you, okay? A common misconception about Rottweilers is that they are a highly aggressive dog and that just couldn't be further from the truth. They make great family pets. They're awesome with children. They can be a little rambunctious, but they're usually pretty good. Obviously it has to do with socialization and training for any dog. I grew up with three Rottweilers as a kid. We had Sanja, Dallas, and Tex. They were all wonderful dogs, no aggression, super obedient, very intelligent. And you know, as a 10 year old girl, I was walking my 120 pound Rottweiler down the street and he didn't even pull on a leash. But the props to having a 120 pound Rottweiler as a 10 year old girl is that everybody crossed the street when they saw me coming, right? Nobody was messing with me. Relax, relax. I got you. I got you, baby. I got you, little baby. You're not gonna like the blow dryer. No, you are not. You are not going to be a fan 
of the dryer. Oh, oh I have my life so hard. I'm a raw wire getting a bath. How dare you? I'm going to wipe your face with the wet towel and try and get some of that stench off. Just want to eat your face. I want to eat it. Me and everybody watching knows that he is not going to like this dryer. If you couldn't even handle the water, Lord knows you're not going to like the dryer. Come here. Are you sniffing me? You're going to see Gidget after this. You're going to play with Gidgey. Okay, I don't know that Gidgey's going to play with you, but we're going to try. And let's see what happens when I turn this on. Good boy. Okay, you're on my lap, you are safe. You are very safe. Oh, no you are not. It's okay, it's okay. No, 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 you gotta stay on my lap. You can't climb me like a tree. Stay. What a sucky baby. You're all right, buddy. Good boy. He's really very affectionate. He loves to nuzzle his little nose under my chin. What a good boy. Yeah. Yeah, you're okay. You're okay, Sully Sully. Look, look how fast you're drying. You're drying so quick. You're almost dry. Yeah, you're almost dry. Yeah. Good boy. You puppies love to be in my lap. I am okay with it. Let me see your itty bitty little paws. Oh, good boy. Very good boys. What a good boy. You sweet little man. Wow, what a brave little puppy. What a brave little puppy you are. Rottweilers don't like having their nails clipped. They're all the frickin' same, so hopefully you won't be one of those. Oh, kisses? Oh, oh, you have puppy breath. Okay, breathe, breathe. I'm talking to me, not the puppy. I don't need another dog, I don't need another dog, I don't need another dog. Oh, you're farting. Thank you for farting directly into my face. Oh, 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 wait, wait, one more. Okay, we did it, we did it. You survived your first grooming appointment. Okay, so yummy. One more, I don't wanna give you too much and upset your stomach, look. But you get treats cause you were a good boy and you survived your groom. Yeah. Sugar cookie? Would you like to smell like a sugar cookie? It smells good too. Oh, little sugar cookie. Sugar cookie action. Oh, he wants more treats. Look at him, he's fiending. He's fiending for the treats. Okay, yes, the groom is over, but I want you guys to stay tuned because I'm gonna bring him outside to play with Gidget. Hopefully that's a really adorable little situation there. But thank you guys so much for watching. This is just your reminder that if you haven't subscribed yet or you're new to the channel, please make sure to hit that subscribe button because it helps to support the channel and more complimentary grooms just like Sullivan's. This is also your reminder that if you're getting a puppy in your family or a kitten and you wanna get them used to grooming, to start as soon as you bring them home because some dogs take longer to acclimate to grooming than others and it's always best to start young. Thank you guys again so much for watching. I really appreciate your continued support and I will see you again in a few days.